And now we have a heart line from Lucila in Peru. Beloved Master, I had a lucid dream where I saw an open place like a beach or something like that. I saw people wearing winter clothes at the beach, feeling very hot and sweating a lot, even though it was winter. They walked and walked in different directions with an aimless, lost gaze. Each time more came, until it became almost impossible to walk. I saw some familiar faces too, some friends from my childhood even. It was difficult to move or walk. However, I could jump and walk faster. I even had a vehicle and I was passing by and was observing the whole scene. I could recognize some faces of people whom I had, some time ago, talked to about veganism and climate change and they had made fun of my words. Now they were in that place, a kind of hell. Once I reached one of the extremes and just when I was talking with a woman, I saw Master in front of me, looking very beautiful and shining. I felt her taking my right shoulder to bring my head to her shoulder. It was the most beautiful feeling. I felt Master's love, and my heart was filled with love. At the same time, at that moment, my hand was placed on the hand of that other woman, understanding how our connection with Master and her love also reaches others through us. It was like taking her to be rescued. I understood with this dream how climate change would affect us to such an extent that we would feel opposite sensations in the different seasons weather. I also understood that the congestion of souls in that place was due to the number of people who would die from climate change. In a previous dream before that one, I saw Master sitting on a chair. There were other people around. I was sitting very close and in front. Master asked me to come closer and she showed me her hands. At first, they were closed. Then, Master opened her hands and showed me some small insects that she had in there. She held them with great affection, and I said to her, Master, I have not behaved well with insects. Master answered me, That was before, now it is different. I now have an understanding and feeling of the love that Master has for every living being, regardless of size or shape, and an understanding of the love that we must also have for every creature. The love for insects was awakened in my heart. Thank you, Master, for your teachings. Thank you for teaching me about love. Thank you for filling my heart with love. Thank you for being in my life. Thank you for your love and guidance. I love you and I send my love. Every day I always offer my hands and my life to be at your disposal and to God. I want to thank the Supreme Master TV team for all the daily work you do, a labor of love and service. Thank you very much. With love, Lucila from Peru. Visionary Lucila, it was very enlightening to read about the spiritual understandings you've gained with Master's compassionate blessings. Master has this response for you. Gracious Lucila, your clear mind in meditation allows us to be close and share the moments you have recalled and I am pleased to be able to reach you in this way. Continue with your diligent meditation and spreading of compassion by helping others in need. Much love, and may divine light always sustain and uplift you in charming Peru. The man who eats meat is a demon in human form. Sadhguru Kavir Sahib Ji, Vegetarian. We welcome your heart lines, stories, and or cute, loving animal people clips. Please send them via suprememastertv.com forward slash heartline.